Generational change is part and parcel of our lives. In terms of space exploration, the Hubble Space Telescope has been doing its extraordinary work for a generation now, and it's time to hand over the reins. What we've reached is the limit of Hubble's vision. As amazing as Hubble has been, we've come up against the immutable reality that Hubble can't, in fact, see everything. Galileo, Herschel, Hubble. Our knowledge of space is marked by some of the greatest names in the human history of stargazing. But who was James Webb? His name is attached to the James Webb Space Telescope, which will soon be helping us understand what lies beyond even the amazing reach of Hubble. Originally called the Next Generation Space Telescope, Hubble's successor was renamed in 2002 to honor James E. Webb, who ran NASA from February 1961 to October 1968. The James Webb Space Telescope's mission duration is a planned 10 years, during which it has a number of specific goals to accomplish. It will search for the first galaxies, determine how galaxies were formed, observe the formation of stars, and measure the properties of planetary systems, both physical and chemical, including our own solar system. Least of all, the web will carry on the task that underlies so much of humankind's activity in space, investigating the potential for life in other far-flung places. The 6,200 kilogram space-based element of the web will not orbit Earth as Hubble has been doing, instead it will orbit the Sun. To do so, it must first travel 1.5 million kilometers, a 30-day journey to L2, the Lagrangian point at which the gravitational forces of Sun and Earth are roughly equivalent. Each orbit will take six months and keep the JWST out of the shadow of both Earth and Sun. Its trajectory also makes 24-7 communications possible.
The web will stay in line with Earth as it moves around the Sun. And that is because while the James Webb Space Telescope is looking for first light, its first task is to find darkness, a condition in which it can operate at its best. Three main component systems make up the space-based James Webb Space Telescope. An integrated science instrument model, ISM, the optical telescope element, OTE, and the spacecraft element. The key to the JWST's enhanced vision is its primary mirror, which measures 6.5 meters across. It comprises 18 segments made of beryllium, the lightest of the alkaline earth metals. A five-layer sun shield the size of a tennis court will protect the JWST's dazzling array of specialist technology. as this orbiting infrared observatory continues the work begun by Hubble. On board are a near-infrared camera, a near-infrared spectrograph, a mid-infrared instrument, a near-infrared imager, and a slitless spectrograph. The NIRSPEC has micro shutters, which will make it possible to observe up to a hundred objects simultaneously. The web's cameras and spectrometers are capable of detecting extremely faint signals, a crucial factor in its attempt to see as far back as first light.